So, the freshen up setting on your washing machine. What is it and when should you use it? Much like it sounds like, the freshen up setting is made for clothes that just... They're not dirty, but they're not entirely clean either. So you can just throw them into the freshen up setting and they will be clean in no time. I think a good example would be, for example, if you've just been outside for a couple of hours, maybe you've been uh, meeting some friends with a nice shirt on, then came back home. And, you know, the shirt isn't dirty, but it's not like put it back into the dresser clean. Uh, in this case, the freshen up setting is good because this is a very short and very gentle setting. It's just gonna kind of rinse it out, uh, whatever is uh, in the clothes. Usually it will be sweat. If it's just light smells, it's no problem. However, if they are soiled, this setting is not going to be helpful at all. Then you're better off going with one of the other settings. In a sense, this setting is a little bit similar to the quick wash or 15 minutes wash in that it is a very short setting. Now, it usually depends a little bit from washing machine to washing machine. On my washing machine, this setting lasts for about 16 minutes, but it can be longer on some washing machine models. It depends a little bit. I will say though that this setting, it's not for like heavy garments. It's not like if you have a pair of denim pants or perhaps want to freshen up your bedding, uh, this isn't the setting. In that case, you're better off just hanging it out, let it uh, blow off a little bit. Uh, same with pants, placing, especially denim, thick denim, I would say you shouldn't use this with, uh, this is more for like the tin, like for example, t-shirt, uh, casual pants, this type of stuff, you know. For this setting, you don't need to use any detergent. It's not really necessary. Since the clothes are already clean, it's just a waste. Uh, however, if you want to use something like, um, I don't know, fabric softener to add a little bit of nice scent to it. That is an option. Just be aware that you shouldn't use too much since this is such a short and quick cycle. You know, it kind of rushes through the entire process of uh, washing, uh, rinsing and spinning. So yeah, not much. Distilled white vinegar could be a great option here. Just pour that into the either the tub or into the detergent tray. Just a little bit will go a long way. 5% is usually a great option for this. White vinegar has cleaning properties as well as this uh, removed smell. So it's a really good option here. On top of this, I will say that depending on your model, this cycle usually can't handle a lot of clothes. On mine it says one and a half kilos. Usually this washer can take up to 10 kilos. So one and a half, it's not much. Usually you can read on the panel of your washing machine how many clothes you can put in there. But as a rule of thumb, I would not go beyond, uh, let's say a third of your washer's capacity. This is such a short cycle, the less the better, really. When you're going to load the clothes into the washer using this cycle, you need to be aware that you should go ahead and go through the same precautions as you would with a regular cycle, you know, uh, separate uh, the different garments. If you have very delicate garments, it is fine to put in this cycle, but perhaps you want to use some mesh bags in that case. Um, yeah, beyond that, don't uh, exceed the temperature requirements and uh, you should be good, really. If you don't have this cycle on your washing machine, good alternatives could be a quick delicates wash as well as the quick wash. But again, you need to be aware of this. Remember to check the tags. Uh, it is still a washing program, even if it is a very gentle one. I hope you liked this video. I've made a bunch more in the past. I can add a video here on how to use vinegar in a washing machine. And I'm going to add a link down below if you want a free laundry savings cheat sheet. Sign up to the newsletter and I send it directly so you can save. I would cut the costs in about half or so every year on laundry. And yeah, I'll see you in the next one. <laughs>